Hey guys, it's Dr. Sharun here, and welcome to our channel, which is called Need Buddy, where we bring daily biology MCQs for you, so that before the upcoming NEET exam, you will have a good practice and a good speed, so that NEET exam you will easily crack. And that's what we are going to do today. So let's get started. Today also, we are going to provide you with daily biology MCQs, which are your practice. So let's get started. Today also, we are going to provide you with daily biology MCQs, which are your practice. So let's get started. Today also, we are going to provide you with daily biology MCQs, which are your practice. So let's get started. Today also, we are going to provide you with daily biology MCQs, which are your practice. So let's get started. Today also, we are going to provide you with daily biology MCQs, which are your practice. So let's get started. Today also, we are going to provide you with daily biology MCQs, which are your practice. So let's get started. Today also, we are Animal cell differs from plant cell in possessing vacuoles, centrosomes, plastids, mitochondria. Animal cell differ from plant cell in possessing. Correct answer is option B. Centrosomes. Question number twenty-four. Algae have cell wall made up of cellulose, galactin, mannins, hemicellulose, pectin, and proteins. Pectin, cellulose, and proteins. Cellulose, hemicellulose, and pectin. Algae have cell wall made up of. Correct answer is option A. That is cellulose, galactin, and mannin. Question number sixty. Stroma in chloroplasts of higher plants contain light-dependent enzymes, ribosomes, chlorophyll, light-independent reaction enzymes. Stroma in chloroplast of higher plants contain. Correct answer is option D. Light independent reaction enzymes. Which of the following is not a primary metabolite? Option A. Cholesterol. Option B. Essential oils. Option C. Essential amino acids. Or option D. Lecithin. Which of the following is not a primary metabolite? The correct answer is option B, essential oils. For example, the lemon grass oil. It is not a primary metabolite. It is a secondary metabolite which is produced in plants. Question number eight. Which one of following is monoecious? Cycas, pinus, date palm, or marchantia? Which one of the following plants is monoecious? Correct answer is option B. Pinus. Question number forty-one. The chief water-conducting element of xylem in gymnosperms are vessels, fibers, transfusion tissues, or tracheids. Correct answer is option D. Tracheids. Question number seventy-two. Vascular tissue in flowering plants develops from phylogen. Pleurome, periblum, or dermatogen. Vascular tissue in flowering plants develop from. Correct answer is option B. Pleurome. Question number eighty-three. An abnormal human baby with XXX chromosome was born due to formation of abnormal ova in the mother, fusion of two ova and one sperm, fusion of two sperm and one ovum. Formation of abnormal sperm in father. Correct answer is option A. It is due to formation of abnormal ova with two X chromosome in the mother. Question number ninety-four. Vegetative propagation in mint occurs by offset, rhizome, sucker, runner. Correct answer is option C. Sucker. Question number twenty-seven. Which of the following is a pair of viral disease? Common cold, AIDS, dysentery, common cold, typhoid, tuberculosis, ringworm, AIDS. Pair of viral diseases. The correct answer is option one. That is common cold and AIDS. Question number fifty-one. Which of the following endoparasites of human does show VV parity? Endo enterobius vermicularis, Trichinella spiralis, Ascaris lumbricoid, and Cyclostoma duodenale. All these are nematodes. You have to tell out of these which all act as endoparasites for human, which shows VV parity. VV parity means gives birth to larvae. So the correct answer is option two. Trichinella spiralis shows VV parity. Question number eighty-six. In which group of organisms the cell walls form 
two thin overlapping shells which fit together. Option A, slime molds. Option B, chrysophytes. Option C, euglenoids. Option D, dinoflagellates. Group of organisms in which the cell wall form two thin overlapping shells which fit together. The correct answer is option B, chrysophytes. Question number 58. Lactose is composed of glucose plus glucose, glucose plus galactose, glucose plus fructose or fructose plus galactose. The correct answer is option B, glucose plus galactose. Question number 99. The chemical signal that has both endocrine and neural role is calcitonin, epinephrine, cortisol or melatonin. The correct answer is option B, epinephrine. Epinephrine or adrenaline, it is a emergency hormone plus it also acts a neural role that is also acts a neurotransmitter in the sympathetic system of our body. Question number 82. Read the following five statements A to E and answer as asked next to them. You can read the statements. How many of the above statements are correct? Option 1, 3 are correct. Option 2, 4 are correct. Option 3, 1 is correct. Or option 4, 2 are correct. The answer is option 3. That is only one statement is correct. So those are the MCQs for today. I'll see you guys again tomorrow with another set of MCQs. Till then, all the best and keep working hard. Do like and share this video if you find it helpful. And if you are new out there, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you guys for watching. Bye-bye.